Hey everyone, I am thrilled to finally show off PhaserBox 2D, our biggest step forward in creating immersive, physics-rich 2D worlds. We've been talking about it for a while now, but today we actually get to dive in and see it in action. We've got 50 examples of this free physics engine at work. While these examples are running in the background, let's chat about what makes this version so special. Firstly, performance. One of the core goals of this release was to push browser performance to its limits. We fully converted the latest version of Box 2D version 3 and then optimized it for JavaScript. It contains features like a brand new soft step bridge body solver for incredible stability. That means better, more realistic collisions and interactions, so every game feels more immersive. There's also island-based sleep management, which pauses calculations for objects that aren't moving. This isn't just a minor tweak. It allows complex, high-speed games to keep smooth physics without lagging or compromising performance. For accuracy, if you've ever tried to manage high-speed objects, things like bullets, fast cars, or falling debris, you know how important precision is. That's why Box2D version 3 includes a continuous collision detection system. This ensures high-velocity objects don't just slip past each other, but register every collision possible. Combined with raycasts and detailed queries, this gives developers fine-grained control over how every interaction in the physics world behaves. It's about ensuring things not only look right, but also act predictably and naturally, reducing bugs and weird glitches. Another highlight is contact events and sensors. These tools provide detailed feedback for collision points and overlaps, enabling rich, responsive gameplay. Imagine creating detection zones that respond to player presence without blocking movement, whether it's proximity-based traps or interactive areas. Sensors make those easy and reliable to implement. What really excites us about this release is just how simple the integration is. With modern JavaScript standards, PhaserBox 2D remains super lightweight at under 70 kilobytes. Perfect for instant messenger games or playable ads where every byte counts. And if you've used the original Box 2D, the great news is we've kept all of the original function names, making the transition a breeze. We also included a getting started guide, a series of extensive tutorials and a Vite project template, all for free so you're not starting from scratch. These features come together in over 50 ready to run examples. These range from bite sized feature showcases to full mini games, each with source code and an example runner. Everything you need to hit the ground running, whether you're building dynamic action scenes or intricate puzzles. PhaserBox 2D is designed to take your games to the next level with stacking stability, advanced joint types, detailed sensors, and industry standard physics that have been honed in on over 18 years of development. We can't wait to see how you'll use it, so register for free, download it, experiment, and let your creativity run wild. This engine is built to handle it. And as always, with every single update, we put out there, you can go and check it out on our website. The link is directly beneath, which will take you to show you everything in written detail. And also all the examples are on there as well. Plus, if you're new to using Phaser or want to get consistent updates on any updates like this, please make sure you subscribe to us. It helps out a lot and liking the video does as well. It gives everyone a massive input as to what's going on behind the scenes of Phaser and also very detailed updates on anything we're producing. See you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.